I think we'll get a real game next week. We've had a pretty good one this week. I suppose what we're missing, what the crowd are missing, is a meat pie from the Honey Badger, as he calls it. Try. You are obsessed. You're not the only one. Everyone's. What's everyone going on about this bloke Nick Cummings for all the He's time? He's going backwards. He's all right, but... Is he in there driving this more miles? You'll see him. Oh, come on, join on, Barnsley. No. I will not. Be a roar if he scores. Pretorius and Bossoff. No, no, Williams will chase. But Falau will cover. Leaking a lot of penalties at the moment, the Wallabies, and I think they're doing it in the knowledge that it's a Barbarians game, and I don't think Jakob Piper is going to go to the yellow card, which perhaps he should. Just going to say the same thing, I think in a, a real test match, one or two of the players will be brandishing the imaginary yellow card in the face of the referee, something that has crept into the game, which is not great to see. And talking of real tests, all gets going next weekend. And on Sky Sports, Sky Sports 2 from 1.30 here at Twickenham, it's England against New Zealand for the QBE International, followed by the start of the Guinness series, Ireland against South Africa. And underway, the programme does at 5 p.m. Sky Sports 2. Fine. Cannot wait. Six. Although this has been a pretty tasty hors d'oeuvre. Away from Lurtu to Pretorius and Bossoff. And Nana Williams. Oh! <laughs> the match! <laughs> oh, Lord. It is a meat pie. That is Holy Ball in the last ball. Do you now say game, set, and match as well? It's not be on board. It's a really good try. There you go, the badger set going crazy. Super try, well worked. Decoy runners everywhere are oh, very nice play. Nanai Williams puts his arm in the air. What's this from the fullback? That's a sweet time on that pass. That's gorgeous from the Waikato man. And they're a very aggressive breed, the badgers, not easy to stop. I think what people like so much about him, he, he's absolutely 100% genuine. Yeah. And you've got to love his quotes. And those in the crowd dressing up like him, well, they will uh, love to see that too. Said when he first saw people in the crowd wearing his garb, he thought, what the hell is wrong with that bloke? Then he realized, they were trying to be him.